Uh, let's see where I've got to find it though, because there's lots of stuff in here. There's, we have lots of Tonys. Listen, uh, Tony uh, reminds us, but again, with quick tips, if you don't know, then it's not a reminder. You get to learn a new thing, which is amazing. In iOS, uh, Tony says, I never realized I could trash from mail just by holding my finger on the archive button a moment longer. And what he means is if you have it so that the default button in mail when you're reading a message is archive. Now, you could have the default button to be trash. You can choose between the two, whether it's, you know, the, the button is archive or the button is trash. Whichever one it is, if you hold down on it, it will give you a little menu and you can choose the other one. So if it's archive, you can, as Tony says, you can hold it down and it changes and it'll let you choose trash. And of course, if it's trash, you can hold it down and choose archive. And that's a super handy feature. I love that about um, mail. I love being it, like iOS mail for triaging mail. It's not as efficient as doing it with a mouse and a keyboard on my Mac for sure. But it's not bad. Like it's doable with especially with swiping and you can swipe left to delete and swipe right to to archive or vice versa. Again, depending on how you have those options set up. But um, but yeah, it's it's pretty good. So.